are you doing, Grandad? Oh, I'm trying to get this motorbike started, Rachel, but I'm not having much luck. I'll come and give you a hand. I think I need a cup of tea more than anything else. Oh, this is the manual, Grandad. I'll read this while you make a cup of tea. OK, love. Perhaps you can solve my problem. Right, Grandad. Let's check the basic starting procedure. Ignition on. Ignition on. Right. Gears in neutral. Gears in neutral, yes. Emergency switch on. Uh, yes. Fuel on. The what? Fuel on. Fuel on. Yes. Choke on. Choke on. Has this bike got an electric starter? Yeah. We need to pull the clutch in to disengage the interlock. Right. Okay. Right, press the starter. Oh, it's no good, Rachel. It's not starting. Grandad, I've been reading a book about the power of thought and I'm sure I can get your bike started. Well, if you could do that, Rachel, I'll be very, very happy. Right, try it now, Grandad. That's amazing, Rachel. How did you do that? There's lots more I can do with the power of my mind. So you can do other things with the power of your mind, power of thought, can you, Rachel? Yes. For instance, I can make that cup move without touching it. Really? That's something I'd like to see. How did you do that? Can I think of something else for you to do as a demonstration, Rachel? Oh, well, yeah. Okay. Um, could you burst a balloon with the power of your mind? Of course. Okay, I'll get one. Well, I think you got the motorbike going and it would have gone anyway. But I don't know how you did that trick with the... Uh, with the mug, but I think it was just a trick. So I want now to see if you really have got power in your mind. Right, so I'll I'll put this on the bench and you see if you can burst it, yeah? Right. It might, it might be best, best if Grandad doesn't know about my powers. Sorry, Grandad, I seem to have lost my special powers. Uh, okay, shall we go in and have a nice hot drink? Yes. Okay, let's go.